morning, my brothers and sisters of Melanin. Good morning to you all. This is Monday, this, uh, I guess, Tuesday morning, whatever. Um, it's a lot going on. Really, there's a whole lot going on. You know, they got this presidential debate or whatever, and our people are just caught up in this calamity. You know, it's all illusions. And sprayed the air. These these troglodyte monkeys and sprayed the air with all these chemicals, causing the air to uh, causing our air to be cold. Yes, our sun is up, but it's supposed to be more like um, eighty five degrees instead of fifty five degrees. It's supposed to be thirty degrees higher. You know, we have really got to get ourselves together. We gotta wake up. We have really got to wake up. It's time for our people to wake up. We're sitting around letting these monkeys kill us, do these public hangings, and they put it on TV. You don't see them putting it on TV when they have to kill their, when they have to kill their own. That's a private affair. But when they kill us, that's a public hanging. But yet still, we still run after these monkeys. We still make friends with them. We don't make war with them. What is our problem? We are the protection of our planet. This message has come to come across to us so many times. And then we get the religious folk to talk about, oh yeah, well you're not supposed to kill because that's the worst thing you can do. Well, what, do you, what the hell do you think they're doing? They're killing us every day. They're putting chemicals in our food. They're giving our people meat, killing us. I mean, and, and the killing is not only physical, it's spiritual, it's metaphysical, it's mental, it's emotionally. I mean, people, some of them, so many of our people are dead in, in, in those attributes. So when do we destroy all of them? When do we wake ourselves up and be like, wait a minute, hold on. This brother right. They don't belong on our planet. This brother knows what he's, what he's talking about. But yet still, we want to be passive. You know? I get one brother saying, oh yeah, you know, that's the killing us the worst thing that you could ever do. No. No, it's not. Because if you need balance on your planet, then you got to kill. What do you think our ancestors did? How you, but the, the, the key part about it, you look at all those people and, and those Frenchmen that killed all those 18,000 brothers and put their heads up. First thing they had to do was get them transferred over to Christianity. They had to get their the mode of Christianity. You're, you know, I already told you guys about how they blasted our magnetic sun out of orbit and cut down our trees of life. But see, we had alternatives to the trees of life. We had the crystals. All right? We had the crystals. The crystals gave us all kind of powers and all kind of abilities. They said, well, what about weapons? All the weapons are inside of us. It's just that our people can't, can't seem to grasp that concept that we have weapons inside of us. I'm going to give you a quick, I'm, I'm, I'm going to give you a, 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 a quick tutorial of who we are. All right. We as people of color are electromagnetic beings, all right? We are binary beings, all right? Electricity and magnetism together is are, are, are two powerful uh, um, elements right now on this planet. Electricity and magnetism, okay? So when we go into meditation, we're pulling in gamma radiation. We're pulling in gamma radiation from the cosmos. We're pulling in gamma radiation from the sun. We're pulling in gamma radiation from the moon. So when we go into meditation, we're pulling in gamma radiation from the cosmos. Now, our eating, this is why we must eat nothing but vegetation. Because vegetation is what feeds our bodies. 
Vegetation is what keeps us going. All right. Your potatoes are full of uranium. So you need the uranium to create that nuclear bomb inside of you. Then you got your your zinc and your platinum and your silver and and and, and, and copper and some vegetables, believe it or not, contain ethereum gold. All right. And then you got all the different crystals that are in your fruit. These are all the necessary elements that we need in order to become proper weapons. Because all the power comes from out of our hands. All the power comes from our eyes, from our minds. So we build our minds up. And we're always thinking about the cosmos and always thinking about the levels of the, the heightened levels of the cosmos. We got to get out of the matrix that's being created. Who cares about Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton? All we need to be concerned about is destroying them all. Destroying every one of them. See, because if we don't destroy them, we could be facing destruction ourselves for refusing to uh, 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 protect our planet. That's almost like a cosmic treason. Turn it against what, what belongs to you. Eating animals. You know, we don't need animals. We don't need meat. They told us, the, 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 the creators told us, said, I give you all the green herbs and the green leaf and the fruit that grows to be your meat. When the creators told us this long ago yeah it was recorded in that thing they call a bible but the creators told us this this is what i gave you for meat in other words all the nourishment of your body is in nature it's not in the 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 beings in nature it's in nature itself your leafy green uh, uh leaves your vegetables your fruit your herbs, spices. That's what all of our meat is. We got to wake up, brothers and sisters. Because like I said, we could be facing destruction ourselves and don't even know it. I need my people to wake up. I need armies formed. You're so concerned about their laws that they're created where they have the right to kill us. But you don't look at the laws of the cosmos where it says that we have we actually have supreme right to destroy them because the laws of the cosmos says those beings of a world has a right to protect what belongs to them. In ordinance of the cosmos, when you lack cosmic laws. You lack the truth. And that's why our people fall for these laws that these these caucasoids created, because these laws are against the laws of the cosmos. These laws are not balanced. These laws are not laws of balance. They're laws of, of destruction created to destroy us and created to preserve them. So what do we do? Do we sit here and allow them to keep doing what they're doing? Or do we get up off our asses, our lazy asses, and get to war? And fight these motherfuckers and destroy them? When do we go in their neighborhoods and bomb shit like they did to our neighborhoods? When do we destroy everything that they created just like they destroy everything we created. This is our planet. But you giving these caucasoids rights that they don't have. I told you they are out of balance. They are out of line with the cosmos. They are literally out of line. They are out of balance. 
and I was, it's our duty to bring balance back. I'm waiting on my army. I'm waiting on the brothers to contact me. Let me know. We ready. Because I'm down for whatever. What do we have to lose? Every time we clock in that clock, we lose. We go to the grocery store, we lose. We pay a bill, we lose. We go sign that piece of paper to travel on our own planet, we lose. Go get a passport so we can go travel across the seas, we lose. We lose on every hand because this is our planet. And we're allowing these troglodytes to do what the fuck they want to do. And none of us want to wake up because we think we're going to lose a, a goddamn piece of paper with a white man face on it. When in reality, we are losing everything. You want the trees of life back? Wake your asses up. You'll get them back. Until then... Until you remain asleep, you'll never get them back. All you got to do is wake up. Every one of you. Pass this message on. Pass it on. All power to the people, Melanin. All power to the people.